Hey everybody, Brian here with Audio Plugin Deals. Today we're going to have a quick look at the Audio Blast Blast Delay. It's a pretty interesting plugin, a bit different from most delays that I have experience with. Before we get started checking this one out, make sure you are subscribed to the channel and of course hit that bell notification icon so you know when we go live with videos and great deals just like this. All right, so... I've got this blast delay loaded up and I'm still just kind of experimenting with it. So really I have probably the most simple thing you could possibly do. Just two instruments here. One's a drum kit and one's an Omnisphere pluck. And without the blast delay, it sounds like this. Really basic, really boring. Um, so I started with just turning the blast delay on with the drums and we can take a look at how it really evolves over time. So there are a lot of steps here involved for this particular preset. So let's watch as I hit play and it goes through the motions here. So you can really see the the one that has the most steps is this time, but I also just did this feedback and you also see it as the filter goes through the motions here. So this one, as you can see, the lower I have that parameter there, you can see as it says, you know, half quarter note, 16, 30 second note, all the way up to 128 notes there. That's how you get that really stuttery sounding effect there. So combine that with the blast delay on the other one. And again, something as simple as that can start to get Pretty interesting, quickly. Again, not a very musical demonstration, but you can see already the different possibilities we have with this plugin. If I click here, there are a variety of presets as well. Um, what I did there was use this preset uh, number 34 called Repeat Again, and that's what I started with to um, manipulate the different parameters there for both of these. So it's all pretty self-explanatory. You can see the length here. You can set the speed here and then the parameter that you'd like these steps to control is all set just by clicking that. So the time is where I hold it down, I raise it up, and as, as you can see right there on the screen, it tells me exactly what um, time base that effect is going to be for that specific step. Thank <laughs> you. 
Okay, so just with a few presets there, now you can see what I've started to really discover with this plugin before I started filming, uh, just how a few clicks can really warp the sound so much more than just a traditional delay, which is what I mentioned in the intro. So a really quick look, just surface look at that, but you can start to see the different possibilities for this specific plugin. Again, this blast delay from Audio Blast. Hope you guys enjoyed this quick look. Go get it now. I'll see you next time.